one of the Cheltenham Festival and look what's happening now. An hour and a half before the first race, the bookmakers already starting to bet they're going bottled two to one against Duvain. They're determined to try and get the banker of the meeting for many people off to a winning start for them. But it really is extraordinary. This group. We're really going into the bookmakers. You can see down there, they're looking around in the main ring in they're looking, there's not much money taking taking part, but we'll see as the business builds up the Duvan a bottle bottle chance very early on. Of course it's going to be a fantastic day with the champion Herbal coming up and how good is Faheen. Now I find it extraordinary. Faheen is top rated by Timeform. Timeform meant to be the wizard of the figures. That's all they go on. How is it possible? They can top rate for he when he's up against a champion hurdler, two times champion hurricane fly, the new one. For he may well be a star. We may well be talking four or five years' time for he coming back for his fourth, fifth win in the champion hurdle. But that's not the point. At the moment, he's not done it and to justify. Some people forecast he'll go off with odds on. Top price around five to four. You've got fantastic offers from the bookmakers of various prices you can take, take the best prices. But how on earth can Fourheen be top rated by a form student on what he's actually done on the race course? It's no good saying on potential and improvement, and that's fair enough. He's not actually done it yet. You're taking a short price. I think that the new one got a terrific chance, the new one unlucky last year. Um, the ground will come right for an instant. The sun's beating down, so it's going to be good. A bit of soft in the ground, but good to soft. Jeski, of course, the, the reigning title holder. And wouldn't it be marvellous? Hurricane Fly, a 10 to 1 chance if the old boy can come back and win his third champion hurdle. It is a, a fantastic sort of start to the whole, uh, whole of the Cheltenham Festival. People dream of it, they look forward to it, they build up to it, they plot and they scheme, and here they are. And it's, as I said, a narrow and a half to go, you can get a bottle, two to one Devane. There wasn't too much of that about in the office this morning. I wonder if one or two bookmakers will go top of their nine to four, and will one or two even go five to two? We'll go and have to see. A couple of odds on charts as well. Fantastic racing we've got. And what a privilege it is to be here. And I've got to ask you, why aren't you here now in the betting jungle? Why aren't you down there? taking on these bookie jappies.